Um, one of the things that, that we kind of recommend before even just doing connection requests is because uh, it's not just that you want to find somebody that's a director or a CEO or a CXO. It's that you want to find someone that has that role but is active on LinkedIn. And so if you can find those people that you're interested in that are posting regularly and start to engage with them in their comments, it's much, much easier to then go and connect with them once you've had some kind of discourse and back and forth with them. Now, that is a time-consuming strategy. Um, oh, no, look, it, you, can, you can make it less time-consuming. Again, Sales Navigator allows you to uh, filter by the people who are active, like, meaning that they've right. posted content recently on LinkedIn. And, mm -hmm. you know, that will certainly lower the numbers because, you know, there's only about one of the challenges in that strategy can, can sometimes be is that there's just the people you want to connect with aren't active uh, in content sharing. Therefore, you know, you still need to connect with them, but if they're not sharing content, then that's, uh, if they are, it's good to do that. A hundred percent agree. Um, and you can um, use Sales Navigator to filter to the ones who who are active and and find them them quite easily without doing a lot of research. So definitely, it's you know uh, it can be a, a good process to to do that. But the uh, at the end of the day, you know you probably be uh, shocked to find that uh, yeah, there was ballpark nine hundred and fifty million people on LinkedIn right now. Only five percent of those those people. Uh, have their profiles optimized the way we're talking about? Only one percent of them actually share content on a regular basis, which is like, you know, one, at least once per week is the the litmus test of regular. Uh, so therein lies, you know, only one percent of the potential people you want to connect with are likely to be, you know, sharing content, and only one percent of that one percent do anything like what we've just been talking about about being very strategic in how they're they're, they're doing their content. So you could look at that two ways. You could look at it and go, well, that sucks. Uh, or you could look at it and go, well, this is my greatest Low opportunity yeah. to, to really stand out and be, you know, you know, so far above everyone else doing similar things to me. And that's really what it is. You, it is a massive opportunity to, you know, just if you can embrace, you know, what we've been talking about today, especially right. around the content side of it, um, to, to really – you know, leverage your your uh, visibility and your credibility very very quickly.